Hello! We are back. I'm Doc. I'm Cam. And Spyro 3, Year of the Dragon. Year of the Dragon. Resumes. Okay. Um, so we got a kangaroo back that way, and we got... Uh, Dr. Seuss Force. <laughs> I don't know if we can open this yet. Do we have 10? Yes, apparently we do. I think we have 16 eggs. Okay, so we can open both. That Was that like a Roman tiki? Yes. That has a weird mix of cultures. Game camera is currently in passive mode. Oh, okay. Spyro's like, what the fuck is a game camera? No. Zoe, what are you talking about? Have you been eating your special brownies again? <laughs> are you holding? What's up? This is a balloon that will take you to a new land. But we can't use it until you bring back one person from each of the five worlds. Oh, okay. I feel like Spyro told them to tell them that speech. Because, honest to God, when you walked into that room, I thought Spyro had kidnapped those people. <laughs> Yay! My portal is working! Is I'll it? see you at the beach! Okay. Alright, Seal. Is he going to be kissed by a rose on the wind? Um... No. Did I get the artist wrong? That was Seal, right? I think so. I don't know. So, how about free the kangaroo? Are we gonna finally free the kangaroo? We're finally gonna free the kangaroo. Alright, let's free the kangaroo. I'm getting paid a fortune to keep Sheila the kangaroo locked up. Oh, are you? Uh, Sheila, eh? The hey? animal must have been causing a yeah. lot of trouble for that poor sorceress. I suppose I could accidentally let the kangaroo escape if you were to pay me, say, a small, a small fee. <laughs> he put a lot of emphasis on hacks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sure. Ah, Spyro, I love your sweet naivete. Your kind-hearted nature might be your See? downfall someday, but for the time being, it's making me rich. I think that's a lie. No, I think Moneybags knows exactly what type of person Spyro is. Oh, okay. He's got his number. Oh, Moneybags is making a nest egg to GTFO. <laughs> Moneybags is all about trying to get out of this dragon forsaken land. <laughs> I don't even know how he got here in the first place because he was in Avalar. Which, whatever. No hard feelings. No, not none at all. No uh, libidos uh, uh, whatsoever. I hope you appreciate I, this all feelings are flaccid. Letting you out. As good uh, as you, mate. No hard feelings, eh? Right. After all, I'm just doing my job. <laughs> <laughs> that was silly. Yes. Steal the money from his sock. I reckon you'd be one of them dragons then. How'd you yeah. figure? How'd you... Spiral. God damn it. Never thought I'd see one. <laughs> you dragons used to rule this entire world, you know. Then all of a sudden you left. Poof. Dragons used to live here? Didn't you know? I thought I killed them all. thousand years ago, I think. <laughs> I don't think he's a thousand years old. The weird thing is, after they left, he just the lost track of his moral code. With them. I mean, they say this world used to have magic coming out the wazoo, flying ships. Man, if I had magic coming out the wazoo, wishing stones, you name it. I want to get that looked at. It all just yeah, seriously. Out. Is that why some of the portals don't work? Wazoos yeah, are delicate. He's starting to fade out too, one <laughs> by one. Well. I gotta get back home and do some. Look, all I know is that they're talking I'm about wazoos right. and putting things in their portals. <laughs> It's a well, very different game than what it was. Uh, the ERSB rating seemed to make it out to be. Yeah. <laughs> and away we go. Sparks looked like a jellyfish there for a moment. Did he? Because his wings were turned downward and oh. frozen. It was weird. Well, Spyro is Thanks voiced again, by Tom Spyro. Kenny. <laughs> now I have to find out what that nasty sorceress has done to my home while I was locked up. You sound really concerned about that, Sheila. Yeah. Does Sheila live in a honeycomb? No. Hiya, Sheila. While you are gone, a bunch of Rhinox kicked us out of our houses. It's okay, though. Bobby, Pete, and I are working on a clever plan to take them back. Clever. Clever. We are German goats. And... 
who apparently are next door neighbors to a Australian kangaroo. Makes perfect sense. Oh. You're playing the kangaroo. I know. <laughs> what was the eating noise? Was that you? Uh. Well, I kicked a bird. Did so... you eat the bird? No. Did sparks eat the sparks bird? Sparks ate the butterfly that came out of the bird. How is Sparks connected to the kangaroo? Uh, it's easy. Just press spiral, spiral, let her borrow him for for a little bit. What at the cost of her soul? Yeah. What, what is the connection here? I, I don't know. So, you see that Lina guy up ahead? He still mad at us for hanging his underpants on top of this tree. That's not very nice. We'll just wait over here while you give him a swift kick. I mean, it sounds like the Rhinoc was a little justified in their anger. Yeah, but they like they kicked him out of the house first, right? Are you or... sure? No, I'm not sure. <laughs> I like the photo bombing sparks there. Look, that Rhinoc was just wearing later hosen and trying to yodel. <laughs> He brutally you can kicked get a really it. Stick I did. Clips like this one with your double jump. Press the X button to jump and press it again exactly when you hit the ground to do the double jump. I don't Once think jumping it, works like that. Anywhere you want. Well, when your tops are made of, made of rubber and your bottoms made of spring, you can pretty much do whatever you feel like. <laughs> you know about the, the wonderful thing about being the kangaroo is you're literally I'm the only one. you're literally the only one. I'm the only yeah, if this is Legend of Zelda, you could bomb that wall. Uh, home at last. But it's not. Yeah, I was saving this to make an omelet, but I think you deserve it more. So if he cracked it to make an omelet, would just like this baby dragon just fall out? Or would it be like gross and horrible and sad? You ever seen like those, uh... I forget what culture they come from, but it's like a... The, the duck is half formed in the egg before you crack it open and eat it. I think it's China. Yeah. Basically that. Last time we tried to get past this moose, he knocked Billy clean through a wall. If you don't mind, oh. we'll just hang out here while you give him a good That kick. sounds hilarious, though. Why don't you just go over there and I'll watch? My sister was bit by a moose. <laughs> a moose bit my sister. <laughs> it's true. Oh, nice catch. You know how many times I've played this game? I was just gonna say, but you've played this game so many times. I think the moose just live here. How did he, like, blo block the door with rocks, though? Have you ever seen a moose running 50 miles per hour down the, uh, uh, six feet of snow? No. I, moose are basically... Sharks. They're a megafauna that didn't die. I didn't know that. I tried moose before. Like moose loaf. Moose burger. Moose burger. I have had a moose burger. That sounds like a Canadian stereotype food that's not really a stereotype food. <laughs> like Louisiana and crawdads. Only it's Canadians and... See, I, I think moose are just too dangerous to hunt. Like, it seems like a stupid idea. They give out licenses. Like, it's like a lotto, at least in Maine. Is, is it like Shirley Jackson's lotto? No, no. Are they sacrificing to the moose no. god? No. A moose from like Brother Bear or whatever? Or are they just going to be like, hey, that's a tasty looking human there. <laughs> you want to eat it? Yeah, I want to eat it. Don't worry. I just keep kicking this rock until it breaks. Oh, okay. I'll oh, leave you to it then. There's the rock hitting tutorial. Man, you wouldn't know how to break rocks if it wasn't for that tutorial. <laughs> kicking them, who would have guessed? Those Rhinox have taken over. There'll be no stopping them unless we can smash the huts. The huts hmm. are too big to smash with your kick attack, though. Try using your stomp attack to smash them instead. Oh, okay. I'll confuse them with taunting while you stomp the huts, okay? You remember how to stomp, don't you? Just jump, then press the triangle button in the air. Two. I really don't see why we're helping the billy goats. 
Like, if we met the Rhinox first, will we be helping them? <laughs> Such a silly noise. Yeah. You sure are destroying those, uh... Tiny mushroom huts. Yeah. How do they fit in there? I'm assuming that those are outhouses. But they, like... If you... If you, like, kick one of them down, one of the Rhinox down, they will... more will come out of the huts. I guess it's so like a clown car. Like clown yeah. Ha! <laughs> that time I got it first. <laughs> Ow. You just had like a pit, pitchfork go up, not pitchfork, a pickaxe go up your ass. <laughs> That's unpleasant. Yeah, considering it went all the way in through the curvy bit. Ugh, I don't, I don't want, no. I'm going to leave that one alone. Your ass turned into a banana smile. Ugh. It's going to really change the shape of the poops. Stop you right there. I'm gonna stop you right there. Just, just keep killing ducks. Well, my dragonfly turned green, so yes. See that video going around of the guy punching a kangaroo after it puts dog in a headlock? Mm, no. I described the video exactly, so there isn't much more to say. Okay. <laughs> Apparently, a kangaroo putting dogs in the headlock is a kind of a thing. It's, it happens from time to time. If you ever forget how to control a character or vehicle, just go to the park. A vehicle? We can drive now? Oh man! Spyro driving seems like the scariest thing. Dragon behind said. the wheel. Look out! Speaking of scary things, I watched the live-action Jungle Book the other night. Did you? You know who's terrifying? Who? Christopher Walken as the giant yes. orangutan. Yes. That was scary. Yes, it was. The singing made it worse. <laughs> and he tried to make like the scat noises, but he's Christopher Walken. He's so white. I don't care if he's done dancing in like Fatboy Slim videos. He's so white. Like you just haven't trying to have a good time, and suddenly from behind you, you hear a ooby doo. I want to be like you. Who, who. And you're like, this is bad. There's a Christopher Walken somewhere. He's going to shove a watch off my ass. Okay. Wow. I mean, I like half watched that when I was visiting my family a little while ago. But, uh, didn't really think about it that way. It was okay. Honestly, it felt like Bill Murray phoned in his, uh, Baloo. Yeah. Like, his delivery was just very, I don't need you anymore, kid. Didn't you realize? I was tricking you. It was a lie. And the kid actor, bless his heart, he was t he was not very good. Oh. Are you stuck in there I... now? I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'll just go inside. Okay. Oh, I was really hoping you were stuck there. No. <laughs> that would have been great. <laughs> and smash it on Billy's house, okay? I need to get him back for the last time he butted me off the cliff. How are you still alive? These goats are horrible. Mostly to each other, but... They tried to eat two of your eggs. They did. Aww. Not... Not nerd female dragons. Yeah. Need some nerd male dragons. Even out the crowd. Level compete. All right. Well, that was another level. Yeah. There's a kangaroo. There's a kangaroo. Name Sheila. Name Sheila because of course she is. Of course she is. She, uh, puns. Barely wordplay. All right. Are we gonna cut it off there? Or yep. Uh, we okay. finished another level. Okay. Hung out as a kangaroo for a while. And yeah. Met some horrible, horrible billy goats. Yep. None of them was a good person. No, they I mean, really weren't. They're goats, so they can't be people. <laughs> they were not pleasant beings. I don't think goats are really pleasant beings anyway. 
goats scream. Apparently, baby goats are very affectionate. Are they? And will scream at everything. Oh. They'll well, scream at the drop of a hat. That's kind of. You terrifying. drop a hat, and that goat is goat is screaming. <laughs> okay. All right. So uh, on that note, <laughs> <laughs> the screaming goats with double eyes. So, ah. You know, love ain't no Billy Goat. Okay, well, I'm Doc. I'm Cam. And uh, see you next time. Bye, pals.